Morning everyone, my name's John from Small Cars Direct, based in New Milton, down in Hampshire. And this morning's car is this rather little striking Smart. So this is a Smart 4.4. It's the one litre petrol engine, prime premium, with the twin dynamic dual clutch automatic gearbox. It's covered just 22,000 miles from new. And comes with full service history. So you've got records of services at 14, 16, 21 thousand miles. Just 180 pounds to tax this car. And economy wise, manufacturers claim figures are anything up to 78 miles per gallon. So very frugal little car. She's just a four seater, this one. Let's quickly show you in the back. So there's two seats here, um, but you've also got a nifty little trick where you can fold those over just to make the storage height a little bit higher if you want to carry something in the back or not have it on directly on top of the seat. You can fold that over and then of course the back seats also fold down so you've got a nice good size loading area actually for such a small car. Um, just flip that back. But Interior condition is really good. Although you've only got two passengers in the back, you've got uh, plenty of storage, cup holders, etc. And not, not bad legroom actually in the back. Although it doesn't look like there's been many occupants in the back because the interior is really, really clean as you can see. I almost dare to say these seats are unmarked because uh, I'm not seeing any kind of signs of wear at all. Also got the benefit of a sunroof in the back and there's one in the front. I'll show you when I get in, get in the front later. But that's just a quick tour of the back and I'll show you in the boot while I'm doing the interior. So it's the boot so it's not huge but it's big enough for your weekly shop I should imagine. You'll probably get four or five Good size shopping bags abreast in there. And then general condition, say the loading area, really clean as the plastics on the inside of the boot. So, no undue wear or damage in there. Does have built in parking sensors just set into the lower bumper there. And then she also comes with these uh, these five spoke alloy wheels around. All the tyres are in good shape. Plenty of tread left on them. And condition wise, really clean. Um, see if I can hone in on anything. Let's. Uh, okay, so there's a few little stone chips just on the bonnet there. Show you the alloy wheel while I'm here. The alloys are in pretty good shape. They've got a few little marks on them, but nothing that detracts too much. Wing mirror house is in good shape. And then up on the roof. It's a bit dewy from this morning, but I can assure you there's no dents or dings up there either. Passenger door. There's a couple of little marks here and here. Rear passenger door looks pretty good. This is the rear quarter. And tailgate and rear bumper again in really good condition. Not seeing any scuffs. And there, he's got a petrol cap. Rear passenger door, driver's door again, not seeing any dents or dings. So yeah, and overall, it's really, really tidy. Interior-wise, I'll show you, we've got a real treat. It's um, well specced, so we've got a, not only leather, but we've also got heated leather. So, uh, you can see there, you can uh, warm these seats up, which will be very useful on a cold morning like today. And then, Jump in. A 
you can see current mileage just 22,000 23 miles and then we've got electric windows so on the other side and you also got the uh, electric door mirrors which are working as well let's check that one yeah that's fine steering wheel you've got a voice controlled Bluetooth for your telephone, you've also got a speed limiter on the left there, and you've got cruise control. Um, it's nice to have on a car this size. And then in the middle, you've got the uh, multimedia system, so you can play uh, DVDs, um, you've got an SD card slot in here as well, USB port. Current news, it's just, uh, there you go. You got navigation built in. Multimedia. It's got a lot of jellyfish around by the sounds of it. Um, yeah, so you've got multi so you can load your pictures, video, etc. Obviously not while you're driving. And then you've got your phone as well, so you can link your phone through the Bluetooth connectivity. So it's up to date with all that connectivity gubbins and then you've got a little small glove box in there it's not huge but you get a small bag in there I imagine um, the general condition again as was as is in the back really the uh, seats really hard wearing surfaces because uh, again the passenger seat it doesn't appear to be any scratching or belt rubbing also got this nifty little storage unit in here as well so you can hide away your your valuables if you need to put jump out of the car and you've got a little netting bag here to stop things flying around you can put a water bottle in there but you have got two water bottle holders here and then also the third one back here and then you've got your 12 volt socket your your SD card point and the USB socket so yeah let's just give it a little rev you've got a dash mounted rev counter it's nice and quietly. Actually drives really well. It's got quite a bit of poke actually for such a small car. Um, and then up here you've got the oops, it's back. Ah, gotta press that one, that's fine. Yeah, so you've got your front panoramic roof as well. These don't open, they're just uh just got the sliding blinds on front and rear. Which is nice to have. All the plastics on the dash, really clean. It's got this nice uh, sort of carbon effect running through the the dash, and this kind of fabric, nice dark grey fabric anthracite finish on the top of the dash. Plenty of big air vents. Oh yeah, let's check the AC while we're here. Didn't do that. Set it through the middle one. Yeah, that's blowing cold. Just double check. Yep. Yep, that's fine. It's all working. Just turn that off here. Okay, let's quickly show you the driver's seat. So again, just the way I've been sat in it. Again, it hasn't really succumbed to much wear. Like I said, car's only covered 22,000 miles, so you can expect it to be uh, unduly worn at this stage. I mean, it's a six-year-old vehicle though, with 22,000 miles, so it's not been uh, it's not been used and abused. It's obviously had a reasonably sheltered life. But there you have it. Quite an unusual car to see on the road these days, but very practical. Like I say, only four occupants, but uh, you know, it's small, easy to park, very cheap to run. So if you're interested in this car, please contact us. You can contact us via phone, email, or through advertising partners, and you can secure this car from just £100 deposit. Um, we also have finance uh, available, with rates currently starting from 
11.9%. So if you do need finance, then again, reach out and we can generate a quote for you. Um, also happy to take part exchange on this car. All we require is your car's registration, current mileage, brief condition report, and then subject to viewing and a quick inspection. Short test drive, we can give you a price for your vehicle. Also, we offered nationwide delivery. So again, you just require your postcode and we can generate a quotation to deliver to your door. And also, finally, we have up to 100 high definition photos of this car available to see. If you're not watching this uh, video on Auto Trader, then uh, if you click on uh, Small Cars Direct website or you go to the Auto Trader link, you'll find us on there um, with 100 high definition photos. Okay, thanks for your time guys. Hope you have a good day and I'll see you soon.